Hello everybody. I hope you're having a great day. After the summer with the kids putting up the dishes out of the dishwasher, this is what a couple of my drawers look like. Look at this. See all that? And here's this one. And on the other side, here's this one. So this is um, 10 year old and 11 year old um, help and it hasn't been so good and I'm having a hard time living with the way this looks the way it you know you can't find anything things are scattered all over um, the kids just basically made a big mess with putting dishes up and so I'm gonna take a little bit of time I'm gonna set the camera up and see what I can get done um, I'm going to guess about 30 minutes, maybe maybe a little bit longer. We'll just see how long it takes. I'm going to set it up, and you guys can kind of see how I get this mess cleaned up um, and more organized. Stay tuned. Oh, and I am using two of these racks. I use a lot of these Tupperware where we lose lids. I use them in the drawers. Um, and I'm going to get everything out of the drawers. Um, first and I want to wash this first and then I'm going to kind of get things moving Okay, so I did wash this out and put the stuff up on the cabinet up here and um, I'm going to get started. So right now it is Let's see 423 You can see it and um, We're gonna see how long it takes to really just clean this mess up really good. So let's get started and find out.
okay so let's see what time it is it is 4 44 can you see it um and i got a lot done so in this drawer towards the back is bigger items like ladles and then over in this corner i have like a juicer you know a peeler and a garlic peeler i have some of my larger forks over here Big spoons, plastic and metal, spatulas, which there's more in the dishwasher, and some ladles. Um, and in the first bin, wood cooking items, wood cooking spoons, um, wood spatulas, and that is that drawer. Over here is kind of more like the baking drawer, um, even though this would not fit. It's a big rubber spatula. I have my other rubber spatulas in here. I have measuring cups. Now, for some reason, I'm missing quite a few of this set. And I guess I'm just going to have to go buy another one. I have some plastic ones. have these just loose in here. Because it's easier when you're just wanting, you know, one or two. Um, and I do have this set. Um, I have my my um, graters up front with my melon baller. Um, I have these. And these are great. These are like uh, measuring cups and bowls. And they're perfect. I love them. I use them all the time. A seal pad. Other miscellaneous items. Such as the bench scraper right here. These um, ice cream scoops I use mainly for um, cookies and um, cake spatula, which I use an offset spatula I use all the time. Um, this is, um, I don't know, one of those little, uh, I don't remember what they're called. You know, they make little pastries and stuff. And my, which is on. Oh, come on. Turn off. This is my meat thermometer that is amazing also. Um, I have some random items back here, and um, that drawer and that drawer look a thousand times better. I'm so happy. I even came over here to this knife drawer. This is not the proper way to store your knives, you guys. I used to have one for on the counter, but I got tired of looking at it. So I'm looking for one of the drawer ones now where you can slide your knives in. For now, I just put like the steak knives and stuff in this little clear bin. Um, back here toward the bag is a knife sharpener, some scissors, a pizza cutter, a couple of these little forks, and then all of my knives. So, you know, it's either better to have them up on magnetic board or in a wood thing, but this is just going to have to work for now, and it is fine. Next up, I will get busy on the silverware drawer, which is also a mess. There's my trusty teaspooner. And, um, I have more silverware than this, so, um... I'm going to have to decide how much I'm going to keep in here and what I am going to store somewhere else. Also, um, I you, you know, my little mixer here holds my items, but my kids didn't put them back. So I got those back to where they live. And, you know, it didn't take long. So I really hope that um, this gives you some inspiration to get in there and clean out your drawers. Real quick, I'll show you a couple of my favorite drawers that's open. These are my tea drawers. I finally put my tea in drawers instead of cabinets because I had lots of cabinet space and lots of drawers. And these are my loose teas. These are my bag teas. And um, I really like the way this is set up. So thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you're organizing. And um, on Tuesdays, there'll probably definitely be an organizing post and video. Um, look, my mom's calling. Call you back, Mom. And... Um, you know, I'm, I'm really wanting to get the house organized, and I have many more things to show you, such as the little kitchen office I have down here, um, and some different ways I am organizing this house. So, thank you so much for watching, so like, subscribe, do all that good stuff, and I'll talk to you really soon. Bye-bye!